Yeah. Come with me to a place you've never seen. Oh me, only Audis, OGs. Skelly's looking at me, ready to attack me. Situation ghostly, down to dispose me. Round and it close me, trying to give me your oh, please. You know what it is, survival of the Yoshi. Mario on the flow, let's go. This is my world and we got control. Come on. Yoshi to win. Hello, guys. Welcome back to survival of the Yoshi. It's been like over a week since the last episode. I'm so sorry. I ended up having to get a new camera. My camera died literally right as I was about to record the last survival of the Yoshi for you guys, actually. And I was debating making one that was face cameras, but this series, it's, it's, it's all about the interaction. I didn't want to ruin that, so I thought it was better to wait. But what I'm trying to say, guys, is welcome back. No more breaks. There's going to be a new Survival of the Yoshi episode tomorrow as well, by the way. Just saying that before we get started. And let's jump into this right now. Before we go anywhere, let's see how Mikasa and Lee... Uh, Mikasa? Hold on. Hold on. Get your, get your names right, Yoshi. Come on. I know it's been a little while. <gasps> Whoa! Liam Ma... Jesus! What happened to you? You can't... Okay, well, yeah, we can just leave this open now. Oh, no. No, he can. He can. He can fit through. Right. Um, buddy... I, li listen, I know I promote McDonald's, right? I don't mean to, I just kind of eat it so much that I, as a person, promote it. That doesn't mean you have to eat it from the moment I left until the moment I came back. I know it's been a week, you probably didn't expect to get that big- What the hell happened to you? I really wasn't expecting that. Okay, well, I tell you what, now that we've seen Leonardo and I guess his full form is that his final form. I guess that's kind of what it is. Let's head down to the wall of fan art I of course have a beau- Uh, hello Okay, not sure what happened there, but let's hope that doesn't happen again as I was about to say though guys I have five new beautiful pieces of fan art to show you come on Can we get through this door without it completely done? What the hell? Excuse me? No, why? Uh, eh, eh. Okay, I've backed up the world from a different point. Let's just walk this different way around. I have no idea what's going on now. I kind of don't want to go through that door. I'm going to go down here into the wall of fan art. I don't know if that's going to make any difference. I don't know what's going on in that space right now, but... Oh, are we good? I, okay, I think we're good. Mo and Tigger are still down here. Hey, guys. How's it going? What are you... <laughs> One more time! Didn't... It, yeah, mm, I don't even know what to say right now. Oh, Mo and Tigger are here! We totally haven't... Live this already. Hey, Mo and Tigger, what's oh well you guys are moving now. You didn't move last time. Okay, I th I th I think we're good. Okay, I don't know what just happened there. Can we get back to what we were talking about? Five new pieces of fan art. Hey Mo, hey Tigger, what were you looking at before? Something is Oh the god, there's not another letter in the chest, is there? No oh, okay. We're good. I don't know what you guys were looking at. Mo still well, I was gonna say that was Mo. Tigger's still chilling under the chair. Tigger chilling chairing. And Mo is just kinda looks depressed. Oh buddy, are you alright? So the first awesome piece of fan art coming in today is from Connor Slevin. And I don't know why I said Connor, because I know it's Connor. Thank you very much for this piece of fan art, Connor. It is the MLG Sheep. OMG. 2 MLG. For. Me. Damn. Manius 3.0 or 3... Zero or 30. I, I don't know which one it is. Very confusing. Sends in this one. Sorry, I can't draw good animals or stuff on a corn. But, uh, uh, on a com. It's not corn, that's a com. Computer is what she means. But I hope you like their humanoid counterparts. And look at this. This is awesome. A few, a huge family photo. Mikasa, Mikasa, Leonardo is like really tiny in this one. But obviously today we've learned that that's no longer the case. He's pretty much as big as all of us. We even have, I didn't even notice the friend who obviously left this chest here in the background there as well behind me, eerily kind of watching on. And then there's Mo and Tigger, and of course, me with a Yoshi shirt. Awesome, thank you very much for that piece of fan art. Next in, we have Evolution Y sending in another Minecraft in-game piece of fan art. Starting to get a lot more of these now. Really, really love seeing these guys, so keep them coming on in. This one says, Hi Yoshi, it's TV Pock. Hope you like the present a friend forgot to tell you about. Ooh, and look at this! This is so dark! There's skelly heads everywhere. Turns out a friend was an ender skeleton. And Mikasa's in the middle. This is crazy! I hope this isn't actually who a friend is. I don't know. I think this is just speculation, but please let it not be that. That that's the one we don't want to happen. 
purple replica soul, of course, coming in with a beautiful piece of fan art today. I'm actually wearing the shirt that this was drawn about. Uh, I don't think people know that. If you're wondering what this says, it says Phoenix. I feel like I need to clear this up because I've seen a lot of people draw pieces of fan art with me wearing this shirt. And no one ever actually writes out Phoenix because I think half of the people don't know what it is. I don't know. Maybe I'm dumb. Maybe they actually do and I just can't read people's handwriting. Or maybe we could talk about this amazing piece of fan art that Purple sent in. Look at this. I... I don't even know what to say about this. The, the the shading, the line work. I'm trying to make it sound like I'm an artistry artist. I'm no, I'm not. But it's beautiful, and I'm just I'm just so happy. I'm like, yeah, the the emotional fist. Yeah, I I need to stop calling it that though. Mm. And finally today we have got one in from Katie saying, I've seen things. Look at Mo right now. I don't know what Mo is looking at right now. I kind of want to see it from his perspective because it's clearly something dark. There's actually a little bit of blood on the forefront of the camera taking this picture of Mo, which I didn't notice before. It could be apples. It could be blood. I'm not sure which it is. Knowing Mo, it's probably blood. The font is dark. Twitter won't let me upload the full thing. Wow, Katie, you you just I'm scared for Mo, 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 Mo. Hold on, hold on, Mo. Are you are you okay? Okay, okay. It's it's not real life, Mo. I love you. I'm sorry. Don't go anywhere. And there we go, guys. Those are the awesome five pieces of fan art that I wanted to show you guys today. Of course, as always, I have transferred them into maps here. So let's. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, let's place them down on the wall of fan art here. Do we have enough? Yeah, okay, we have enough spaces. So first up, we have got OMG to MLG. Let's place that right next to Space McCasson. I, I love that piece so much. We have a mysterious friend who we hope isn't actually the friend and is simply speculation. We have Family Matters, a nice family photo there. Beautiful. We, of course, have just the emotional fisting that I need to stop calling it that. Thank you very much, Purple. And finally today... We'll put one there. I've seen things. Yes, Mo. Yes, you have. You know, when I came in, I thought you looked a little depressed. Maybe it wasn't depression. Maybe it was just awe. Like, you've seen... Hold on. You, you guys were both looking in that direction. Did someone go through the nether portal? Because you looked scared. And Tigger, I think, just wanted food. But he was also looking in that direction. So, uh? I checked there wasn't another letter in there, right? I did. Okay. Okay. Maybe they're pranking me. I wouldn't put it past Mo or Tigger to prank me. Actually, they just look at stuff and think, Oh, yo, she's a paranoid person. He'll get paranoid because we're looking in the same direction. <laughs> that is what I imagine goes on in their minds. And what is probably going on in their minds right now. They're very intently listening to me, guys. So, I think they're pretty proud of their handiwork. You got me. Let's head back up here. Let's hope we don't have any more game freezes. That has never happened, ever, on Survival of the Yoshi. So... I really don't know what that could be, and I hope that that doesn't ever happen again. And I don't even know what I did to fix it. I literally just restarted Minecraft three times, crashed three times, did the same thing a fourth time, and now it works. I, uh, yeah, don't ask me. Minecraft, why why you do these things? Of course, though, we have three lucky blocks to open at the start of today's episode as well. I have got six placed over there ready for one at the end of the episode, too, so I won't be forgetting. I know that you guys think I'm always going to forget the lucky blocks, and yeah, most of the time I, I do... I'll admit to that one, but not today. Not on episode 52. Oh, no. Now, what I'm kind of hoping will happen is, you know, because I've had a little bit of time away, unplanned time away, and, you know, I haven't opened any Lucky Blocks in a while, maybe they'll be feeling generous and they'll want to give me something really nice. You want to do that? Let's open this one to begin with. Oh, we... Okay, we got some hay. I'll, I'll take that. That's more food for Mikasa and Mikasa when we get her home. So, okay, that's fine. Let's do this one here as well. Oh, we got a bunch of enchanting books. I haven't been using enchanting books, really, but I kind of need to start doing that. But yeah, look, I need to start doing that. Okay, I'm an idiot. And let's choose one more for the start of this episode. We have... Where's the fourth one, actually? Uh, okay, yeah, we got one there, one there. One on that little block island over there, and then one there, too. Let's do this one. Let's do the one closest to the bridge, because then we can come back and we can open the rest. And that was just wooden tools. That was awful. Oh, there's a Mr. Chicken in there too. I didn't realize there was a Mr. Chicken that survived. Do you remember when we got all the chickens and we got the diamonds from them? I thought they all died. Oh. Also, I don't know what you guys are doing in there, but whatever you're doing, stop it. You are clearly kissing right now. Chicken dog love. What is... Okay, survival of the Oshi, everybody. Let's carry on with the episode. Not question what we just saw. So before we go any further, I have got a bunch of comments to read out. But before we even do that, 
I wanted to show you guys some changes that I made to the world. There was nothing huge, but because I did have some time where I couldn't record a new episode of Survival of the Yoshi, but I still kind of wanted to work on things, I made some more lamps, and I literally just filled out the sniper perimeter a little bit more. I'm not... I'm not, I gotta say it, okay? I'm not happy with the name Sniper Perimeter. It isn't catchy enough. Guys, we need to get some suggestions going for what you want me to call this thing over here. So let me know. So, all the lamps that are done now, we have it starting off here. It goes all the way around, continues on down, and then it stopped last time about there, I think it was. I had enough lamps and everything that I could make to, it goes just behind Mo and Tigger's houses. So, after you get to that point, I'd say about half of the bridge is done. We've actually made really good progress on it. It takes quite a while to get all the stuff you need for these lamps and everything, but we are halfway there. And I'll pr I'm thinking about it, I'm probably gonna finish the rest of the lamping and the lighting of that off camera. Because it is boring, it is just resource collecting and then placing it back down. I'll probably finish it off on camera so we get the completed build moment there and then we can check it out and enjoy it. But I think I'm gonna do most of that. So I just wanted to let you guys know about that before we started off. I have a bunch of comments from you guys to read out, so let's read some of these and see what you had to say on the last episode. Firstly, from Dale He says, uh, the Underground Railroad was from your Tech It series. Yet now it makes sense. Because there was so much confusion in the last one. People said that I had an Underground Railroad on Survivor of the Yoshi. I was unbelievably sure that I didn't. I had no recollection of it. But then when you make me think, oh, Tech It, I remember it right away. Yep, you're right. That was where it was from. So at least one thing from last episode is cleared up. We know that, no, there's no mysterious Underground Railroad on Survivor of the Yoshi that we're going to hope to come across. Because it doesn't exist, so we won't come across it. Mystery solved. Put to bed. Close the book. Shut it up. And, and I don't know, other words for... Stopping it. Now this one's about to get really deep. Okay, the last few comments I'm gonna show do have us doing a few things around here that I've already prepared for. I've got uh, a mailbox, which I will talk about very soon. And uh, a bunch of other things that you guys want to see me do. But first, we, I think, have the prophecy. That's right! The prophecy! It's from Afternoon Raccoon. I'm gonna continue looking over here because it's quite a sentence, but here we go. Yoshi, there are some things you need to realize. Your friend could be Herobrine. The Ender Dragon is waiting. Mikasa is yet to be found in the overworld. The end is yet explored. The heavens have not been added. Heavens are what you need. Heavens are what we need. The heavens are where Mikasa is. Heavens are known as the Aether. I am so tempted right now for next episode to add the Aether in. I really want to explore the Aether in Survival of the Yoshi. I think that would be amazing. Although, what I am confused about is Mikasa got kidnapped before we added the Aether in. We still haven't added the Aether in. So, I don't think she'd be up there now because it doesn't exist. However, if the skeletons find out we've got it, I don't know how they'd access it. But if they do have access, they could put her up there. So, it would also actually complicate finding Mikasa because there's one more big area that she could be in. But I do like that idea. Also, Nate versus Gaming comes in with hashtag prophecy. Totally agree. Hashtag it, everybody. Let me know what you guys think. Would you like to see me add the Aether on Survival of the Yoshi? Let me know. And thank you, Afternoon Raccoon, for that suggestion and telling of the prophecy. Now then, let's start off and actually do some stuff. The first other comment that wants me to do something comes in from Andrew Prep saying, You haven't been to the other side of the network in a while, and just the potion room, all of this kind of stuff. You never know, that's where the skeletons could be hiding and scouting you out. Safe to look. With Riley Field saying, True, and the Alternian Autobot saying, Never thought of that area. I didn't either, but not for the same reason that you didn't. I didn't think of it because I thought there would be no chance that they'd be able to infiltrate this. But actually, when you bring it up, it is a pretty good point. Oh, what am I doing? It is a pretty good point. So, we'll just check around here. I don't think the chests have anything in them. Although, we do have this strip mine down here that we'll need to check. I swear, if I go down and there's just skellies waiting. Okay, okay good. Okay. I actually probably have to explore all of these pathways. God damn it. I completely forgot I did this back in the days when you'd strip mine in Minecraft. Damn, this was a big one, actually. Look at this. There's some coal down here if we ever need it. Not that I need coal. Wow, these are some memories right here. This is insane. Let's check the other end. See if there's anything around here. Anything? No. Okay, so bottom floor is all clear. How deep did I go with the other one? So they go all the way across? I can't have spent that much time. No, I didn't. Okay, I was going to say, if all of the floors 
act in the way that the bottom floor does? Damn! I put a lot more work into that than I remember. But no, they, they don't. That's what they were gonna be. But I don't know, man. I don't know if strip mines are something that we need to continue with. Back in the day, they were, you know, pretty cool. Now, uh, no, probably not. Although if we're really desperate for resources, I guess we can. There's nothing in here. I'm che- Okay, that was the last one. No, I've checked every one, so there's nothing in the chest and- What do we call it? The- I guess strip mining- mining area. I completely forgot about this area AGAIN! I did that last time! Oh my god, what's down here again? Nothing. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, no, there is something. God, man, you scared me. I'm not gonna lie, you saw me flinch. You saw me just jut across the screen there. I did not expect that. Because I looked at it, I saw something in the corner. I thought it was like a weird furnace that I'd put down. I thought, oh, it's fine. Okay, there's nothing down there. Well, well there was, but there's nothing anymore. Do they work with the skellies? That's a good point. I don't even know what those things are called yet, but do they work with the skellies? We have our potion room here as- Ooh, hold on. Was this? Did I- What? Oh, yeah, okay, this is where the enchanting room is. Hey, hey, you know what? We're down here. We have some stuff that we could enchant. Let's enchant it. What should we do? Let's do the chest plate and the leggings. Let's see what we can get for this. So we have 21 levels. We can get 15. Let's see the highest we can get. 15 is still the... 16 goes up to... Come on. Give us like a 20 or something. You know you want to. Oh, there's a 19. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to go for it. What do we get? Protection 2. It's great. Okay, there's nothing down there. Oh, no. Oh, hold on. Do I have cobblestone? I do have cobblestone. Why are you using the hay bales, Yoshi? Those are my cat sons. He's got to eat those. Now, okay, I'm not going to look up for a second because I think I saw something weird coming in and I want to explain this. I thought that I didn't place this cobblestone down, right? I, th I think I did because I made the enchanting room. On the other corner of this room, I'm actually kind of nervous to look at it. On the other corner of this room, I think I saw another block that looked out of place. And I'm pretty 100% sure that I didn't put anything there, so... Yeah, I definitely didn't do that. Oh look, there's Leonardo through the wall. Hey, buddy. I definitely didn't do that. Uh, do I want to? Hold on. Let's let's not just jump on it. There's... Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna eat some food before going down here. Really? No, no ladders. No ladders, guys. I didn't do this, right? I don't remember building this here. What is? Oh, oh, skellies! Ho oh, ho ho! You're screwed, guys. We got him. We got him! Holy crap! Please say there's more to this than just the uh, CCTV camera. I don't know if that's still a thing. Is that actually a thing? We never found out if that was. I just kind of said it. But it kind of paranoid me out, so screw it. I'm going to take all the skelly heads down. Right. Is there anything else secret here? Um, is there anything underneath? Because we've found something. I don't know. I don't quite know what this is yet, but we found something. Please say there's more to this. If they have a base. If they have a base in my potion room, I swear to God. Okay, let, let's, let's see what this is. This is a map. This is a map of every... This is the whole mountain network. Yeah, 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 because look. Oh, my God. So there we are. Which, yeah, which makes sense because this bit here, this is the potion entrance. There's the farm. There's the second bit. So that's the treehouse network. And okay, I got it. I got it. So we're there. This gives us a really good overview of the island, actually. I'm probably going to take all of these and place this back up in my own base. I mean, don't get me wrong. Please do not think that I'm going to just leave this here. Oh, God, I've said that now, and actually that seems like a really good idea. I know that sounds dumb, but if we leave this here, the skellies come back and they won't know I've disturbed it. If they know I've disturbed... We'll get onto this another time. Let's just have a look around here. So, they've got to have something hidden around. Then over here, we've got... Right, then that leads to the Lucky Block Arena. Okay, so there's the dock, right? This is the front side of the island. So then down here, yep, there's the sniper perimeter that we need name for, continuing around there. That's like the tree farm there. Oh, my God, look at all of these landmarks. This is crazy. So, why did they even have this? I mean, the best thing I could think of is, yes, surveillance. Because, I mean, hold on. So, it shows me on the map, right? If they're looking at it, do they see me on the map? Because if they see me on the map, that's dangerous. They know where I am at any one time. I mean, as long as I'm in the mountain network. Who knows? They may have maps of other bits of the world. I, I, obviously, they're not here, but I don't know. But if they know wherever I am in the mountain network at any one time, that is really bad. Crap. Okay, yeah, I'm going to take all of these maps. I'm gonna grab these. Do I not have enough inventory space? I don't! Okay, uh, what, sh what should we drop? Let's drop the clay. Let's drop the skulls. Let's drop the wooden tools. We don't need the wooden tools. Okay. Do I have all the maps? No, no. Let's grab that. Okay, we're good. 
Uh, did I? No, I didn't fully check this down here. I'm gonna dig down a little bit more really quickly. I want to see if there's anything else underneath here. The further I get down, the less I'm thinking there is. I think that was probably just like, I mean, look at it. It's so, how do they even get down here? It doesn't make any sense. But I guess it's just a surveillance room. That is smart, though. I did not think they'd be able to see me on maps. I don't know if they actually can, but if they can, as I've said a lot. Because that scares me, guys. That is really bad. And we need to find a way around that, actually. We can't just take the map down. We need to stop that. And yeah, I don't think there's anything down there. Okay, well, guys, I'm going to head back up then. I don't know what to do next. Wow. That's really stumped me. Damn. Then nothing else secret in this room? It's not a trap chest. No, okay. So, guys, I guess all we can actually do is just accept that we found that and keep that in mind that they did have that in the mountain network. I guess we got to look out for a lot more suspicious things going on around here then because how did they infiltrate that? I mean, sure, I didn't check that part of the mountain network as much as I probably should have. I agree with that, and that's what the comment said. But still, they did. We have to be on the lookout. Although while I'm now here in my inventory, let's let's try and forget about that for a second. We'll come and figure more out about that a little bit later. I do have this mailbox in my inventory. I did mention this earlier. And this leads us on to the last comment of today that I chose. Saying from Glob of Doom. Saying... I fucked that up. Glob of Doom says, you should put a mailbox at the second dock because that might be why the friend asked you to make a dock. I don't really know. Anyway, nice video. Thank you very much, man. Also, Zeshan Mahmood also said, check the mailbox. Ak, uh, ak, 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 and the new dock, which kind of forms into what we're going to do. So I think that's a really good idea. It's very basic, but it makes sense. If we have a mailbox at one end of the dock, and then let's have it on the other one we have. And it covers both sides of the island then as well. Again, I was trying to think about it as well while well, I had some downtime on recording this. I do not know why our friend, or a friend, I don't know if I feel comfortable, being comfortable calling him our friend yet because we don't know much about him. But our friend, I have no idea why he wanted us to build that dock. I, I can't think why at all. I mean, it, maybe like a skelly ambush. I was going to say a skelly ambush, but there's something there. And I think I know what those blocks all together mean. And I think what it means is that there's a new letter. Please say it's from a friend. I mean, it is with his signature. I'm pretty sure it's from a friend. But just let it be nice. Don't send me on a journey to go and build like you a mansion. Okay? I, maybe I over-exaggerated how long the dock took. But just don't... Don't do that. I mean, I guess that kind of defeats the whole purpose of having a mailbox anyway. He doesn't even care. He just lays his own little emeralds and chests down. Again, I'm not complaining about the emeralds. That's really cool. But he just lays it down. Whatever. We'll place one down here anyway. Where should we where should we put it? Let's put it on there as well. Okay, let's take a look at this book. Building an army. And it yeah, it's by a friend. Okay. I'm going into this with no more expectations, guys. He's just gonna Oh god, I don't know what's going on. Hello once more. You probably weren't expecting another letter this early. Uh, no, I wasn't. That's why I'm setting up the mail, but okay. But some things have changed. A dark time is coming, and we need to band together. I'll let you know more as I find out more myself, but until then, maybe you should start adding some more members to your mountain network team. We could use all the help we can get, a friend. Okay, a dark time is coming. Let's not go to the end of it yet. A dark time is coming, and we need to band together. Well, firstly, I guess that means we'll be seeing him soon. I mean, I hope so. Right? If we're banding together, don't just band together by sending me letters and then telling me what to do. Band together by you being here in the flesh and helping me with this, okay? You seem to know a lot more about what's going on. You're talking like a dark time is coming. How do you know a dark time is coming? I didn't know a dark time was coming. How do you have that intel? You know, so band together with me. I, I don't even know where that conversation's going. I'm just... This is what happens when you only write letters to me and expect me to be your friend. I end up having conversations with the letters. I mean, it says that he doesn't know as much himself anyway, as I find out more myself. So I guess he isn't fully clued up on it. He just n knows that a dark time is coming. But until then, you should maybe start adding some more members to your Mountain Network team. So I guess he means Mo, Tigger, Mikasa, Mikasa, you know, those kind of guys. Leonardo, can't forget Leonardo, main player in the game now. And we could use all the help we can get. Okay, okay, a friend, that's, that's not too big of an ask. In fact... I have an idea of who I might go and see to join our team, guys. We've seen them in a while. There's three of them. 
and they're hanging around all the time. They seem friendly. They get into arguments. I'm pretty sure some of you guys might know who we're talking about now. But uh, let's go over there and we'll go see if they want to join us. Now, one thing I will say, though, is that a lot of the times in the past I have kind of... You know, you guys have seen it. I haven't even been doubting, but I've, you know, I've been interested in a friend's motives. But right now, I actually don't care what his motives may or may not be. I think that is actually a really good piece of advice. We do need to add more members to our team. And we're arriving here now. The two people- No, not you guys. I'm sorry. I made that seem like it was you guys. No, it's, uh... It's not, I'm sorry! The two, they're all the way over there! Crap, the people we were gonna add, I'm calling them people, they're not people. The goats, I think that might be a smart idea. The billy goats. Now, my thoughts behind this, okay, we need new team members. They kind of eat anything, so they won't be taking much food from us, so that's resource easy, right? And they've also got these huge horns on the top of their head, so I think, you know, attack, like defense, melee-wise, they're probably quite good. So they would make amazing additions to our team. So here's what I'm gonna do. I think... I did say they eat anything. I think that's probably how you tame them as well. So I'm gonna bring one of them over here. What the f... Why are you here? Skellyhead? No, 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 no. Don't be playing those games coming at me from underwater. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna put him near here, though. Maybe just give him, like, a cooked steak. I don't know. Does he, does he want that? Do you want that, buddy? I, I saw you eat that. Do, do you guys want another one? Have, have one over here, man. Have one over here. Yeah? You, you enjoy that? You like that? Is he, is he with us? I, I don't know if he's with us. Stop butting heads and eat food. Just, just eat all of that. Look. Look. No, stop. Stop eating, stop eating the cross and eat the amazing Kentucky Fried Chicken I've just placed in front of you on the sand! Or those sandy chicken. Mm. Mm. Oh, these guys are, these guys are stubborn. Come on, guys, stop it! Eat! Eat some food! I saw you eat some of it as well, you can't even pretend. I don't know how much food you want me to give you. You over here, you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm, all right, you know what, do I need to break this up? Do I need to break this up? Come on. Come on, get out of there. You're like a naughty school child. Just get up on the mountain, right? Have a piece of chicken. I saw you eat it before. There you go. Have another one. Right, have a few more. Eat them. Eat them. Hey! Uh, we just had to right-click on him, I think. Choose your pet's name. Oh, God, what should we call him? I should have waited to choose a name. Why does it make you do it now? I should have waited to choose a name for your guys' suggestions. Okay, choose a new pet's name. He's He's a goat. He, he makes cheese. He has horns. Um, ho ho horny goat cheese. No, no, we're not calling. We are not calling someone on Survival of the Yoshi horny goat cheese. You know what? I don't know where this came from. It just kind of popped into my head, but I kind of like it. Hornsworth. He, cause he has horns. He, he's, he's a posh goat, I guess. Oh, it's Hornsworth. You can't say the name Hornsworth without saying it like that. Oh, it's Hornsworth. Right, can we see if we can recruit this second one? That's all you had to do is- I just wasted so much chicken. Jesus. Okay. Second name. It's Nigel Hornberry. Oh! Hey, guys! Oh, look at these guys. Nigel Hornberry. I know, that's probably the worst thing I have ever said. Well, at least in a long time. So, you know, pardon me for that one. But, uh, Nigel Hornberry and Hornsworth, and they're still fighting. Okay, let's just let's wander back home. They're they're our team now. I was gonna call them our pets. I don't feel comfortable calling them our pets. They're our team. So let's hope they at least follow us. Come on, you're not even gonna follow us. Just follow me. Oh my God, you guys! I swear. What do I have to do? Maybe there's like a right click option with them now that they're actually my pets. Let me see this. I know I wasn't called them my pets, but they're not following me. They're clearly not abiding by the team, so... Do you want- do you want to- do you want to come with me? Hornsworth. Horn- Hornberry. Nigel Hornsworth. Look, don't pretend you can't swim, because we know you can swim. I'm kind of hoping I'm just gonna go far enough away and then they will come with me. I don't know if that's how that's gonna work, but either way, we do have two new team members added to our team here on the Mountain Network. And actually, you know what, thinking about it, that's kind of a good place for them to be. They're kind of our lookouts. We don't have a real lookout. I mean, we have all of these guys around here, but news doesn't travel fast with them. That's, you know, goats are fast. If I offer them some kind of food, they'll hurry back to me quick with news. So actually, that works. 
That works out pretty well. Well, guys, now that we have recruited them, I'm going to head over, open the last three lucky blocks of the day today, and finish this off here. But thank you guys so much for watching so far. I don't know why I'm trying to finish off an outro before I've even opened the lucky blocks. The reason I was trying to, I do know, is because, yeah, I'm going to have another Survival of the Yoshi come out tomorrow as well. It has been a while, so I thought that would be a nice little way to make up for it. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Make sure to stay tuned tomorrow. But it's not over yet. We still have three more to open. Which one should we go for first? Let's go over here. I'm going to eat for first as well so I don't die if I do take hits. Okay, that's a good idea. First one, we got some tools. Okay, I mean, my diamond pick is nearly out. I need to repair that. Second one, ooh, a lucky sword. Sharpness three, smite three, fire aspect two, looting two. Uh, looting one, I'm breaking one. Ooh, that's a nice little sword. I'll take that. Shame it isn't a pickaxe, because that would have been more useful in this situation right now. Last block, though. Oh, we got another redstone one. Oh, and actually, that's awesome. We got more lamps from that. Oh, fantastic. I can do more work on the sniper perimeter. Yeah, give me a name. Give me a name for the sniper perimeter, too. It needs a better name than that. Guys, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Survival of the Yoshi. One more time, I do apologize for the break between this episode and the last episode. But we're back. Another episode coming tomorrow. Stay tuned for that. I have been Yoshi Mario, And if you enjoyed, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. But until tomorrow, I will see you all a little bit later.